Hi guys, I am Ankesh and welcome to my channel. So today we are going to create our first DevOps pipeline. The agenda of the meeting will be to understand what DevOps pipeline means, how to create our first pipeline, to understand how different tools come into picture, to launch AWS instances and work on it, to install and configure all the middleware that is tools and to integrate all the tools on the top, top layer as a CI CD pipeline. At last, we are going to automate the whole code deployment process. So, this is the DevOps periodic table. If you see, we have some uh, verticals like SCM, which is source code management, and for SCM, we have tools like GitHub, GitLab, Bitbucket. For CI, that is continuous integration, we have tools like Jenkins, Bamboo, Team City. The same way, if you go with a build, we have tools like Maven, Gradle, and et cetera. So if you want to see this periodic table, I will give a link in the description. So coming to the pipeline, DevOps pipeline. So how this pipeline is formed? So it consists of the steps. So the first step is to plan. Plan means to create tickets or to create a roadmap to go with the uh, deployment. The second is to create a code, the code which developers are going to create. The third is to build it into a packages and then comes into test. Test means there will be different type of tests like unit testing, integration test, functional test. And then releases will come. Releases in a sense, it will go and get released into different environments like the test acceptance in production. After it is successfully released, we are going to operate on that. Operate in a sense, monitoring, reporting, logging, etc. And then the uh, rinse and repeat. That means once everything is done, it has to get repeated once the next build of codes are getting pushed into the repository. So for this DevOps pipeline, we are going to use these two sets. So there are five tools we are going to use. The first is Bitbucket for source code management. The second is Maven for build. The third is Artifactory for uh, Artifactory. It's a JFrog Artifactory. The fourth is Jenkins for CI and CD. The fifth is Apache Tomcat for web servers. And how these tools are going to connect? They are connected in a way source code management that is Bitbucket has to get connected to the CI CD box, which will be polling it every time. The second is the build tool, which is Maven, has to be connected to our CI box. The third is JFrog Artifactory, has to be connected to our CI box only because it has to get the artifacts from the build to our Artifactory server. And our deployment server, which is Apache Tomcat, which will be internally connected to our CI CD box, that is Jenkins. So thank you for watching the video. Hit like if you really like the video. Subscribe to my channel. And if you have any queries, comment down below. Thank you.